we took a ride on a really nice bike. This is called the Nocto Super Cruiser. Very cool looking bike. I love the wheels on this thing. And it's just got a really nice svelte design with this 26 inch, four inch fat tire. So you can ride this pretty much anywhere. It's got fenders, which are included, which is amazing at this price point. A comfy seat. It's got the front headlight, a very, very nice controller too, with a thumb throttle. It's got a six speed Shimano shifter and five levels of pedal assist with a 500 watt motor. It'll get you up to about 22 miles an hour of pedal assist or throttle. It just, I mean, it just looks like a great looking bike. I mean, it looks like a beach cruiser. So we took it out for our first ride around the neighborhood. Again, we're in Florida, it's kind of flat here. Got it up to about 23, 24 miles an hour. And you could tell it's just a really comfortable, stable ride on flat roads. We took it on some dirt, on some grass, and it feels really good with the front suspension really taking a lot of the bounce out of the road. So that's really nice. Took it on some nice little trails here and it rides very, very nicely. A lot of people aren't even aware that this is an electric bike, which is kind of nice to have gone incognito if you're concerned about things like that. Very smooth, very fun ride. You can take this just about anywhere. It's not the full 750 watt, although this model is available in the 750, but some townships have ordinances that won't let you ride a 750 watt. So this fits neatly into the lesser class, so you won't run into any legal trouble. Tooling about the neighborhood got a lot of looks. People are like, hey, that's a pretty nice bike. Is that electric? And yeah, you didn't even know. You see the batteries placed in the back underneath the seat, which I think gives it a little bit more a little bit more balance as far as the weight distribution. It's just a really smart place to, to put the battery on a bike, on a frame of this size. So it was time to take it off-road. Can this thing go off-road? It is 500 watts, so it's gonna have a little bit of trouble through sand, but through hard packed dirt, no problem at all. As a matter of fact, Fresh got a little bit of air here. I don't know if he was expecting this, but he took it off a little jump. Look at him, there it is. He's acting like a kid again. Overall, a great bike, an excellent ride, and an excellent value, too, at this price point. The Nocto Super Cruiser. Check it out if you get a chance, and you can pick one up online.